What's up guys, Bigger here. Tutorial, very quick transition, very simple, very easy, but it looks pretty sweet. And uh, go ahead and check it out real quick. Let's go. So, I don't know what to call this. I think I'm just going to call this a uh, warping transition. But, uh, it's like, meow. So it's almost like CC Lens, but not really. But I think it's pretty sweet. So let's get into it. So I'm going to go ahead and delete that. So what you're going to have is uh, two clips, right? And uh, they can be overlapping. Well, they need to be. Um, do not want to have some black in between. But you have two clips. Okay, so we're going to make a new adjustment layer. And uh, Go ahead and delete that. Okay. So I like to uh, trim my adjustment layers just so I can see them in the timeline easier. And then I know it's an adjustment layer. Otherwise, you'll have a big long bar. But so that's cool. And uh, we're gonna go right when the, this first clip ends. So right about here. And I go ahead and type in optics compensation. So this effect is normally used for uh, reversing distortions in like fish fish eye lenses. So like you know, kind of warps it to kind of fix it. And this is actually a pretty cool right now. I mean, to bring it up or something, but. We're going to set that to zero and reverse the lens distortion right there. And what that will do is it'll bring it this way, which kind of looks like you're going through some kind of like, you know, time vortex or something. Yeah, okay. Never mind. So we'll go to this spot again and we'll set a keyframe all the way up to the max is 180. And yeah, okay. So we'll push U on the adjustment layer to see our keyframes. And we'll go back about uh, almost a whole second and set a keyframe at zero. And on the other side as well, zero. And uh, yeah, looks half a second to a second. And make sure you make these uh, easy ease keyframes to smooth out the animation. So it'll kind of slowly start and just like that. And that's pretty much it. Very quick tip. Meow. And of course you can add some uh, color correction to make it like super bright and uh, come back to normal or do kind of like a color shift maybe. But optics compensation, reverse lens distortion, keyframe from 0 to 180 to 0. That's about it. Please leave a like and yeah, peace.